All right, what do we got next, Ed? We John got Travolta what do we got? Still alive. We got DVD releases coming up. Yes. Here we go. Why would he not be alive? Was there something going on? Well, the, the Cotter deaths. All oh, right. <laughs> Sin City, a dame to kill for. Well, this did not do very well, Dave. Yeah. But Mickey Rourke is looking better. <laughs> with the makeup on, right? Yeah. It's yeah. He was kind of odd looking, and now he's better looking with all that makeup. You I like the first one. Yeah, I never saw it. I have it there, ready to be watched. Well, I'll watch it. But when you wait eight years in between the mm. films, I guess it's people. It, it's are... worth watching just for Carla Gugino. Uh huh. Oh, Gugino. Oh, Gugino. She she showed her Guginos <laughs> in black yeah, and white. That doesn't no. matter. Doesn't matter. The shading is beautiful. 22 Jump Street. This made a ton of dough. It was a surprise hit. Yeah. Party on. I don't, uh, I don't get it. <laughs> Is that it? Oh, there's more. If I Stay. Oh, very sentimental, touching film about a young woman who's not sure if she should die or live. Well, what would happen, Ed, if she stayed? Was this another one where there was a car accident? I don't know. Was it a car accident I producer? I think it was. Yeah. Oh, God. And I guess, uh, you know, coma-ish. Oh, so oh, a violin player. Cello or whatever it was. Yeah, yeah, yeah whatever. If I Stay. Well, Remember, this was very similar to your Days Mortes film. <laughs> yeah. It was outside her body. <laughs> Step up. All in. Look at those fake abs. <laughs> this is the one where they... Put everybody together from the previous five installments. Oh, there's five? I don't. I think so. Oh crap! That's like those Fast and Furious I've never seen. I didn't realize there was like seven or eight of those. Yep. Number seven coming out, I guess, with the deceased. Uh... And so it goes. I cannot recall anything about this, but I'm pretty sure we did it. <laughs> <laughs> right? I kind of remember we did it. What it's about, I don't know. Well. They have wonderful something or other there. Well, <laughs> who knows? Uh, yeah. Well, at least Michael Douglas is, you know, hanging in there. <gasps> Look at that head. Look at that. Isn't that timely? The cabinet of Dr. Caligari. Must... With that fine German expression, expressionism. What a, yeah. what a fine looking film. Yeah, I'll have to look at it. I think this is Blu-ray. So it might be nice to look at nearly a hundred year old film. Dave. I believe 1921? Yes. 1919? Somewhere, somewhere there. there. Yeah. Yeah. And that's it. That's it. How sad. Well, we also have uh, birthdays. I'm we're... pixelated. <laughs> oh, God. Am I? <laughs> Over here? I almost wasn't going to wear it. That's, that's for, uh, yeah. But, eh, who cares? <laughs> we did fix that one time. It was jiggling wires. Or it was a switch on the box there, wasn't it, producer? Wasn't yeah, it what? It's a bad, bad. The whole, the whole thing, thing is bad. bad. We need a switcher. No, we don't. Don't replace it now. We're coming to the end of the Can run. Can we do a Kickstarter campaign for a new switcher? <laughs> it's just this show's coming to an end. No, no, no. Don't put no money into it. And believe me, if we stop, if all of a sudden the show ends, it's because the switch went and we just didn't want to buy another one. And that's it. We're done. <laughs> What's next? Uh, oh, the birthdays. Segments. Oh, we have birthdays? Oh, we got deaths. Oh, first. we got deaths. That's cool. Oh, really? Oh. Uh, uh, uh. Uh -huh. That's all he Seven did with those two things, I think. Uh, well, he was a dancer and choreographer and painter. And, and, and who's that beautiful young woman then? You know who that is? I do. Yeah. Jen, uh, Jane, Jane Seymour. Jane Seymour. That's from Live and Let Die. It is. What was that, 74-ish? Three, I three. believe. Yeah, three. Look they, at that. Oh. Now she's all <laughs> fake and small. <laughs> oh, the good old days. Jan Hooks. Oh, not Jan Hooks, Dave. Yeah, yeah. These are Saturday Night Live has been taking a hit up throughout the years, too. She kind of looks like uh, a frumpier version of Mary <laughs> from Peter, Paul, and Mary. Oh, God, never that. <laughs> That's a little unfortunate. She looked uh, kind of cute there. W where? On the loft. You think? Yeah. All right. Well, that's what happens, I guess. It is. 56. Oh, come on, Ed! <laughs> a heart attack, gastric bleeding, alcoholism. 
What? Wow, oh, those, are, well, those are tiny. Horrible. And that is the smallest black bar that you had. <laughs> That's not for what movie is that? For? I found that on the web. I didn't do that. Oh, folks. That's oh. Where I found that. Oh, with the bar? Yeah, with the bar on there. So I'm, I'm not going to take an effort to put a bar on, but since it's right there, <laughs> I'm going to include it. And then uh, she didn't hold up too well on uh, the, the right there. Well. You know what, Ed? Yeah, we're not, we're not either, I'm telling you. I saw a picture of me from 20 years ago. What a difference. That doesn't look like the same person. And look, that's, she's the mother, right, producer from the family? Uh, yes. There you go. Not anymore. Not anymore. How are they going to explain that? Somebody's going to sit in front of that camera. They're not explaining what's going on. Marcia Strassman. Oh. Uh, 66? 56. 66. 66. 66. Kind of cute back in the 70s with the big, huge glasses she was wearing. Yeah, I seem to remember she didn't have a bazier on a lot of the time. And maybe she should have. Oh. I you don't know. think that would have prevented it? <laughs> I don't know. Maybe those need supporting. But it was funny, though. I felt kind of bad for her because all she did in the show would be at, like, at the ending scene when in. he came home and started explaining things. Mm -hmm. And that's it. She was in it for a few minutes. But then she was the mother from Honey, I Shrunk the Kids. Yeah. Honey, I Blew Up the Kids. She was on MASH, uh, some of the early yes. MASH. Yes, that's correct. You see Cotter there in that picture. You don't see much of him except at a reunion. Look at Cotter up on the upper left. Yeah. Ooh, poor Gabe Kaplan. Well, let's see. How many are going now from the Cotter cast? Uh, got... One, two, three, four. Yeah. Four out of that picture. And, oh, don't forget the uh, Hotsy Totsy also passed Who on. the hell's Hotsy Totsy? Deborah Lee Scott. Oh, she's been, but she, hasn't she been yeah. for a while? Yeah. Her, her fiancé <laughs> was killed in the 9-11 attack. Oh. And one part of the reason they said that she ended up dying was she basically was very heartbroken over that Ooh. and uh, never got over it. And speaking of that subject matter we were talking about earlier, uh -huh. Deborah Lee Scott was the victim that they took out of the ground in the first or second Dirty Harry. Oh, really? And, and she was nude and oh. in all her 70s glory. Oh, really? Yes. It's a good thing she wasn't dating that guy. <laughs> oh, yeah. He wasn't. Too happy with that. How, that a, how old was this guy? How old is this guy? Because if he was dating women in he, the 70s, yeah. you'd think he'd be used to this. Yeah, apparently he was happy with the changes that occurred in the 80s. Oh, work for it, buddy. Yeah. Make make a game out of it. Go buy a little <laughs> shaver and have some fun there. <laughs> oh, Richard Keel. Richard Keel. Jaws, a Hulk. Now, he was... Uh, What's that? No, he was cast as the Hulk in the first movie. And then the, the, the son of the producer, somebody said he, he's not big like the Hulk, and he meant the, in the muscles. And they only kept the one shot of Richard Keel in there because it was uh, probably expensive to do. The camera was way up high. Remember he was saving the girl out of the lake? There was a shot way up high, and it zoomed in or out on him, and there he was. That, that's all you'll see of Richard Keel as the Hulk there. In the upper right, that's him from a Twilight Zone episode. Yes. Um, uh, to serve to man. To serve man. It's a cookbook. It's yeah. a cookbook. <laughs> who now? It wasn't Richard Keel, but was it Ted Cassidy who did the voice of the Hulk, the right. growl of yeah. it? Yes, okay. and the uh, narration. All oh, right. I always got him mixed up early on. Was it Richard Keel or was it Ted Cassidy in uh, uh, Longest Yard? He, it was sometimes he had trouble. Richard Keel. No, it was Ted Cassidy. It was Ted Cassidy. <laughs> yes. See, oh, you yeah, mix them right. up. It was. I barely remember the movie. Yeah. Oh, well, what's next, Dad? we got six minutes to go. Well, I think uh, it might be a good time to saunter over to the game So, segment. no birthdays. Did yeah. we do birthdays? Oh, we yeah. got to do the birthdays. Do we? Yes. All right, we'll do them quick. Sure. Yeah, zip through them. They have quick. to be done on the correct week. Okay, quick now. Quick, zip. I snapped my fingers, but I can't. I had surgery <laughs> on the hand. I You've can't had snap. surgery since the last time. All right. I believe we taped. Celebrity birthdays. Maggie Gyllenhaal. <laughs> Another speaking of subject matter oh, again. Yeah, she's, yeah, she's not shy. No. She's not shy. I don't know how old she is. 37, 38. 37. 37. Do, do, do. Danny DeVito. Oh, I think it's a big birthday for him. 70? I think it is. Oh, not Danny DeVito. 70. There you go. Owen Wilson, 45-ish. <laughs> do you remember some of the comments you sent? Oh, I believe, I can't believe he even made it this long. <laughs> right. Why does no one talk about Owen Wilson and his, his suicide? It's like it never happened. Yeah. Alan Young, 
Not young. Not young. Now this is the one from Mr. Ed. No. Mr. Ed, yes. <laughs> yes, he is. And Not the, doing well either. Oh, no, that's a shame. Oh. Scarlett Johansson. Speaking of that subject, Vera. 30, 32 ish. She was in a movie where she was totally nude. Did you get what that? movie? What? She's playing an alien. I, I can't think of the name. And not, uh, 60s, Jamie Lee Curtis? No, oh, she's, yeah, 50s. Right. 56. She was never bottomless nude, Jamie Lee Curtis. No. But she was topless. Topless? Well, let's get back to Scarlett Johansson. Was she bottomless? Yes. What? Get me that film, she, too. I'll send you a photo. She was playing an alien. Oh. And because it was such an art piece. Oh, of course. And a dramatic role, right. she was Very decided artsy. to go fully nude. Oh. Well, that's good. And speaking of that, uh, I think we're well overdue for a New Year Doc game okay. coming up soon. All right. All right. Ed's going to be going over to the, what is this called now? I forget now. Post oh, Repairs geez. game? Haven't done it in so long. Where people have sent in their guests, uh, two numbers uh, from one in one to six, and we, we pick out your name and we reveal what's behind the two numbers. And if they match, you win two free movie passes. That's right. Spin the wheel. Spin the wheel. You can win up to ten. There you go. Show Ed now. Yeah, I'm all, I don't know. If I, should I tuck this shirt in or not? No. Too no, late now. Right there, huh? Too late now. All right. I'm gonna hold it, Dave. Are you? And you're gonna pull. Okay. You're gonna pull on it. Oh, yeah, get one out of there. No one can see what's going on. Oh. Where are we? Over right. here. I'm going the wrong way. There we go. Don't All right. forget, only a few more weeks left uh, for this batch. All right, here we go. Pamela, Barra, Harder. Two and three, Ed. Two and three. That's and the three. old next to each other ploy. Oh, I didn't open the party popper, so if you win, it's going to be quite the chore. <laughs> I believe in the next couple of weeks, this is being released on Blu-ray. Oh, I didn't know they even made one. And oh, oh. Our web series Dave that was slated to come out on Halloween. <laughs> Delayed and as of this date, there's a good chance it might be out. I first, doubt it. The first episode for Thanksgiving, Dave. That's Is a it? good. That's a good holiday. I think you better wait for Halloween <laughs> again next year. It's uh, awaiting. The first episode is awaiting one scene it's oh, to, okay. to be shot. Or was probably shot uh, a week or so ago. Oh, okay. What's the address? Uh, there it is. Look at the back of the thing. Oh, jeez. Uh, All right, folks. If you want to enter the poster pairs game, just send us an email. Send it to this email address, which I don't know off the top of my head. Oh, oh there it is. no. And we've been on hiatus, <laughs> and I don't know. Mediazone95 at gmail.com. You can read it for yourself. Just send in an email with uh, two numbers from one to six if we select your entry and we reveal your two numbers and the posters match, you win two free movie passes. And if you write spin the wheel, mm -hmm. we'll bring out the mighty Schwinn <laughs> and we'll spin the wheel. happened back here? <laughs> Must have been one of our water. Uh... Oh. Yeah. We'll spin the wheel and you can win up to ten tickets. You could lose your two tickets, but you can win ten. Six, four, whatever. Somebody won 10 not too long ago, right? This year, in the summer, I, I believe, I right? I don't remember what I had for dinner yesterday. We weren't, we weren't invited. Uh, yeah. No, we don't get passes. There you go. Oh, here you go. If you spin the wheel, you have one chance to win 10 tickets, two chances for six, two for four, you unbelievable. <laughs> six <laughs> to keep two, <laughs> five, you lose one, two, you lose them <laughs> both. Wasn't any pepperoni on that pizza, was there? Or sausage? Four meats? <laughs> the, the four meats blend? <laughs> All right, so uh, we'll be back next time. Uh, don't forget, we are look actively actively searching. Are we? For our new female <laughs> co-host. And uh, as long as you... Not if you keep doing that. <laughs> no. All right, we'll see you next time, everybody. Production.